Hello, beautiful people of the internet, and welcome to episode number seven of the Void Frogs podcast. My name is Stiflerd, and I am joined once again by a man who has a bit of command blocks experience himself. Just a bit. The Q Magnet, and of course, one very special guest. Oh, Hi. yes. <laughs> from data packs to zombie attacks, from blocks that are scary to boss battle adversaries, he has been fire, created planets, and destroyed them with his Death Star. Squeezed Minecraft into a single block and put our brains into shock. And he's done all of this with only one command. For the most part. to his superpowers, <laughs> the one, the only, it's a Minecraft! Hello, yeah. thanks for having me. You like that? Somehow your, your sound cut off like in oh, the intro it? for me. Oh, <laughs> it was so loud. <laughs> All right, I'll start again. From no, down, no, 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 <laughs> no. No, this is taken to, the people do not know, hey. but I'm going to let them know. Every yeah. single one of these episodes takes like 20 minutes to get started because Q... <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Here's how what really happened. We got a, we were ready to go. And we got a message. Says, oh, I'm not ready. Stiflerd. I'm not ready. With his name, and unless somebody hacked his account, you know I'm what? not ready. And me and Itch were like, okay, well, I guess we will you wait know what? for you. Ija, thanks so much for being here today with us. <laughs> thanks for having me. <laughs> Uh, Glad to have you. Here. <laughs> um, so it is Ija, right? It's I- Ija, not yeah. I J A. Yeah. Ija. A no. lot of people don't know that. I think. Yeah. Yeah. I I had some people who pronounce it like all different kinds of ways, but <laughs> I, I think some people even take the M from the Minecraft and pronounce it like Ichem or Ichem. Oh. <laughs> Itchum. We need to come up with a new translation or like a new pronunciation. Let's go with uh, mm-hmm. e, e. J. M. Enocraft. E. J. M. Enocraft. Yeah. Sounds fine. All right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm going with that. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. That's great. Uh, e. Hey, so um, I I do want to talk some more about your name because I had some stuff that I was really curious about about it, but. Uh, before we get into that, uh, Nija, would you mind telling our audience, the people who are listening in right now, who are watching in right now, who are you? Who are you? What do you do? Well, I am kind of a YouTuber. <laughs> I, kind of. Uh, yeah, kind of. <laughs> I started out with um, like a time lapse video and some tutorials. Mm-hmm. And later on, I transitioned uh, to command block videos, which I'm probably most known for, mm-hmm. like stuff in one command block, oh and also God. some, <laughs> also some map like here or there when I have time. Yeah. And after that, I was like inactive for three years or something. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> like yeah, yeah. I made like one video here, then waited six months and made <gasps> another one. And then, yeah. Oh, so you're like, kind of like yeah. me. I don't make videos. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> till, till now when I uh, kind of yet again make like one video every week mm-hmm. with like a data pack or a cinematic or a time-lapse video or something like that. Right. And I hope to, or a comparison video like since the last month I made some of those yeah. and they were kind of successful, strangely oh, enough. Kind of, kind <laughs> of. <laughs> Like we, we we were lucky enough to get you on the show, and then all of a sudden this video comes out, and you're like, "I'm like, what happened? Where?" And you and you, I believe you said, "Ah, just the algorithm." I'm like, yeah. oh my god, you millions of vi- it's like your biggest video, is it not? Yeah, 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 yeah. I think so. It's kind of, kind of kind of strange. You like make videos with like put put like 20, 30 hours into each video, and yeah. do that like for three years, and get like. What, what do I know, like 40,000 views on a video. Yeah. Yeah. And then you get like 5 million views in like three weeks. And oh, it's like my God. all the work of the last two years in one video. Yeah. 
it's yeah. cool and all, but, yeah. but you look at that and say, yeah, it's, it's kind of cool, but also, what did I do the last two years? It's also kind <laughs> Minecraft of Minecraft probability <laughs> comparison. That was the one that blew up. Yeah. And, yeah. The, and the size comparison one as well. Yeah. Wow. I, I don't know. Uh, comparison videos seem to do quite well on YouTube yeah. Yeah. lately. Yeah. Or like since <laughs> three years ago or something like that. Yeah. But I didn't expect the video to do this well or... Yeah. I, I expected it to get like some views, right. maybe reach like 100,000 views in like yeah. two, three months or something like that. Because uh, looking at my video views now, you might not expect it, but since like in February, starting of February, most of these videos that have now like 300,000, 200,000 views were like pushed up because of these big videos. Before oh, that, yeah. they had like 10,000 views and my working zombie army that is now on like 300,000 views is mm. was like stuck at a month, for a month at like 3,000 views. So yeah, it's, it's, it's kind of crazy how if you got one big video, all the other stuff goes up as well and somehow everything explodes. And yeah. YouTube algorithm yeah. takes all the other stuff and recommends it. It's kind of crazy. We have that it, vibe. People get like... Wait a minute. Are they going to get itchy on void frogs? I think they are. Let's go. It's like it's like the secret stock market. They're just like, yeah. watch his videos quick. <laughs> that's exactly. Right. That's exactly it. Uh, <laughs> but you're more <laughs> than just a guy who who's gotten a lot of views recently. You've you've actually done some some really incredible stuff. I don't want to I don't want to break into it. Q has like a list of things here. Yeah, yeah. That he he really wants to get over, uh, get 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 to. Um, and one of the first things, I, like I was mentioning, I have a question about your name, Ija, Ija Minecraft. Mm. Okay. So like, what does it, what does it mean, Ija? Cause I, cause I did a Google translate. I know you're from, uh, Germany. Yeah. I believe. Right. Uh, and so yeah, J A means yes. Well, I, I just threw I J A Ija into Google translate and it also said that oh. that means yes. It's like iPhone, Ija means I yes. yes. iPhone, I yes. Uh, no? yeah. I, I mean, ja means yes in German, but yeah. Yeah. I, I, I don't think itcha has a translation or means anything in German. I, I, I googled it like a month ago and there is some strange language. I, I couldn't tell if, if it was Asian or some kind of East European. But mm. they, they, they have the word itcha in like every video title. Uh, I don't know what it means. <laughs> wait, wait, also, wait. You've okay, had well, this name wait. for years. <laughs> what? You, you don't know what it means. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What? How's that? <laughs> you just picked random letters? Is that what you're saying? Uh, no. I, I, oh. I don't know what itcha means. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Because it's not a word. It's, it's, it's an acronym. So yeah. it's, it's each letter for? stands for something. What, what okay so what when really, I, we really want to know what your name means that's what we're really trying yeah, to get at yeah when 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 i started out match i started out with youtube channels like in 2011 right. i had some random names like in german and stuff like that and in 2012 i wanted to make a new break and created a minecraft channel and i thought of a name like i i, I wanted something with minecraft in the title okay. but i didn't know <coughs> Where, how I should put it. And I think at the time there were some YouTubers who, who had like short phrases with Minecraft in their names. So I, I thought maybe like Minecraft is just awesome. Might be a good mm -hmm. title name, oh. like channel name. And then I thought maybe this is a bit long, too long. So I just shortened the is just awesome to oh. each other and put it at the front. And now it's just, how I got to my name. Is it, have you ever shared that with anybody before? I think so, but I, I don't know where. I, I think I taught about uh, It's just awesome. I, I, yeah, I, I had a, a frequently asked questions on my yeah. website like a year ago, and okay. I think it was written on there, but but the site doesn't exist anymore. So, oh. yeah. <laughs> it's just awesome. You are just awesome. My that's goodness. That's cool. Oh, thank you. You too. <laughs> <laughs> mm. I, I That's actually really cool. I, I I'm surprised by that. That's uh, it's just awesome, dope. Yeah, actually, okay. So, 
the first thing I want to say before we got into your name, so your name was the second thing. First thing I was going to say, you've actually been retweeting our our podcast episode. You are like actual fan, man. I can't yeah. believe it. Awesome. <laughs> I can't believe it. It's like, I, I mean, I, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I, I haven't seen any Minecraft podcasts yeah. till now because I'm, I don't know, maybe maybe I'm just, I don't find stuff. But <laughs> it was very, very fun experience to, uh, yeah. to, to watch your podcast and learn about all these different people because I don't know every one of them till now. Right. Like I know Mac Markenstein, um, yeah. Mac Markenstein, <laughs> and, yeah. and Eddie Beatmaker. And I, if I saw Nook Screw with some stuff of them, but I haven't really known about the people like this before. So it was very interesting to watch these episodes. Yes. That's good stuff. <laughs> well, let's just spend the rest of the podcast talking about the podcast. Yeah, yeah. Uh, fine, fine by me. Sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> what have you enjoyed? Who's your favorite guest? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> wait, wait, who's your favorite host? Huh? Hey, there we oh, go. Hey, I want to know on. right now. Real job, real job. <laughs> All of them. Oh, Every last one on. of them. <laughs> good I feel answer, gypped. Good answer. Oh, good All right, answer. Enough about our podcast. But thanks for, for sharing it. Anybody out there yeah, wants to seriously. share? Go ahead. Um, yep. So going down our list here, <clears throat> I noticed, maybe this is just a design choice, but your logo there, mm-hmm. it's kind of got an I and a J. It's just kind of mashed in the background. And you emphasize the A on the front with a creeper face. Is there any specific... Reason for that, or just look cool? Uh, yeah, um, it's, it's not actually my my real logo anymore. I think. Oh, I, I, the old <laughs> I, logo. I, 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 yeah, my old logo. <laughs> I, I switched the logo like a year back or something okay. like that. <laughs> yeah, um, Come yeah. On, I, I just. Team. <laughs> hey, I watched a ton of videos this week. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> I didn't look at the dates properly. I'm sorry. <laughs> but in the oh past, yeah, 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 yeah. In the past. I, I put it like in every video, like at the top corner, and like it took up like one fifth of the whole video screen. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that, that was fun. <laughs> yeah, but it was going. You did the little bubbly sound yeah. effect, and then it yeah. would come up, and mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. I, I, I just found this this really cool uh, Minecraft font online. I like. I found two of them yeah. to be exact. Like one with the fin letters, which is used by Minecraft in the in the menu menu buttons and stuff like that. And right. I found a figure one, which is more similar to the Minecraft logo. Mm-hmm. And I used this one to just, I kind of had no ideas how, how to create a logo for a channel like Itcher Minecraft. So I thought, why not just take my Itcher letters and put them in like a very good looking position. Yeah, <laughs> and then yeah. I thought this, this font had, has a nice, nice creeper face on the A, maybe put that in the middle. and can animate the letters coming in and out of the screen when when yeah. in the video so my, my, yeah there's 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 no really great story behind the logo itself you, well you're yeah. emphasizing the a is what i was saying because you're mm. so awesome yeah yeah it's 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 the most important word, word yeah. of the of the title awesome yeah, so. awesome yep mm-hmm. fantastic yeah. Uh, well, I'm going to, I'm going to show your logo, your actual real logo up on the, on the YouTube version. Old so logo, he said. Everybody. Yeah, I'll show yeah, both no. of them. We'll, we'll do the comparison. We'll let the people see. Mm. But, uh, yeah. So YouTube people, yeah. you guys get to see that right now. Sorry, audio only yeah. people. Subscribe. <laughs> Subscribe. Um, yeah. okay. So let's go way back when you started, uh, or maybe at least when your YouTube started, um, mm. you had that I could maybe you had one before this, but you had a cut. You had a different skin than you have now. You're you had a dude yeah. with a beard, and <laughs> his mouth was going down to here, and then you had uh, put a scarf on later, and that's kind of your thing yeah. now. What's going on there? What you got? You, he got too cold, and he had to yeah. cover up his face. <laughs> Is that what happened? Yeah, um, I had a few skins before that, and yeah. one was like a, a sh- sheep standing up with like. A, I don't know how the character is called with this hockey mask, like this killer hockey mask. How is that this character called? It's like in a horror movie. Jason oh. Voorhees. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that's him. And yeah. I had that skin and then I thought maybe that's not the right choice for, for my Minecraft channel. <laughs> so <laughs> Come on, kids, watch the video. <laughs> so I redesigned it and I, I don't know, I... I um, it, it was some, some German YouTuber back in the day who had, I, th- I think Manu or something like that, who had uh, uh, blue skin 
And I fi- I I liked that one. Okay. It was like a blue monster thing. And I thought, why not create something like that myself? So I just selected like four different blue colors and put them on my skin. <laughs> <laughs> it looked good. Then, then I had to think of a face. And mm-hmm. I don't know how it happened, but somehow, <laughs> somehow I made like a... a gigantic mouth because I thought it was cool that the mouth was not like on the head part but also on the body part and yeah. I added a beard around that yeah. even though I don't have a beard <laughs> <laughs> oh you don't have a beard we are starting yeah, to yeah. learn what you, we can just imagine it, it. we'll draw you at the end of the episode based on <laughs> spread. <a> draw <laughs> <face reveal. laughs> everybody in the comments draw his face in the comments okay <laughs> oh man yeah. so, okay yeah, go and ahead. so I don't, I don't want to lie to my viewers anymore with the beard right. thing. And so I just yeah. put a, a little scarf around my head with like lila colors, just because that looked good. And right. yeah, that's pretty much it. How I, I got to my skin. Yeah. You didn't no. want it. You didn't yeah. want okay, it. It so took me a while to figure that was a scarf. I thought it was like a robot mouth, and I'm like, oh no, there's a little, little hangy uh, thing there. Yeah, yeah. maybe. If so I made it red, maybe yeah. <laughs> Your 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 skin is is all blue. It's got blue skin and everything. It looks kind of to me. It looks a little bit like gelatinous. And I wonder sometimes when I look at people's skins, like what is their what is their their character made of? And I ask that question. It might be a weird question, but it's very near and dear to my heart. See, my skin is like tree bark because my my skin is a tree mm-hmm. person. Okay, so what is your skin? What is what is? Are you like gelatinous? Are you like Gumby? You know, like what? What are you? Yeah, I think I like to think of myself more of like a very hairy human, so like with blue hair. Okay. <laughs> yeah. But but, but <laughs> hairy. But, uh, very, yeah, very hairy. Very, very hairy. <laughs> like like a with blocks that are monster. scary to Minecraft skins that are hairy. We should have done that one, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but but maybe looking at it now, I I have this like. Big black eyes with this with these tiny uh, white pupils. So uh-huh. maybe it's it could be like an insect. Oh, I don't know. It oh. looks a little bit like that, like yeah, it, gelatin part. Yeah, thing. It yeah. reminds me of like a Muppet. I don't know if you have that in Germany, but like Kermit the Frog yeah. and Cookie Monster. Yeah, Island, that's what it reminds me of, like a cute guy. And yeah. then you got now. Do you still have the command block side head, or did yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, with a yeah. command block in the head. That's right. Oh, oh, I've, I've, oh I, I just noticed I don't have that in my logo itself. <gasps> oh, no. I was trying to be relevant and modern. <laughs> Doesn't have it. Yeah, yeah, I have you it got... in my skin, but oh. I don't have it in my logo. So oh. that's that's kind you of better fix that. problematic, yeah. I see what you're saying. Wow, yeah. this, so we've been lied to the whole time. This isn't the real yeah. logo. This is an imposter. <laughs> just so inconsistent. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, that's okay. It's on the other side. It's on the side that's hidden, right? Yeah. <laughs> maybe I, not. I don't know. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know myself. It's like, here's, like years ago that I created this skin. Here's what I would love to see. I would love to see some IJA fans out there. I'm, I'm doing a call out right now for IJA fans. All the new ones coming from the podcast and the old ones. I want to see you guys make some fan art of Ija all blue and hairy and also <laughs> like an insect yep. and like a gelatin thing with bulging insect eyes and yeah, yes. just that sort of stuff. Oh, just those right. little b- details. No yeah, problem. I think I'm going. Hey, you know, I if you I'm actually do, get... we'll, ha- we'll show it on the show, maybe a contest. I don't know. Do you want to do yeah, that? Yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll tweet it I'm out going. and everything. Ichi will you give you that. his credit card if you win. Go! <laughs> Uh, okay, so uh, moving on here. Uh, <laughs> you are German. English is not your first language, correct? Yeah, as yeah, as one might tell. <laughs> okay, no, yeah. you're doing great. Um, yeah, I have a very thick accent. Some people tell me. <laughs> a lot of people tell me. Apparently, I think it's well, great. It is I like wonderful. Yeah. F- I, thank you very much. <laughs> the, the reason I I asked that is because I don't know if you're a fan of him, but a lot of people are a fan of Yes for the End. Um, mm-hmm. was a really he doesn't do Minecraft anymore, but he was a brilliant command block guy, and he he was from the Netherlands, and he told me he learned to speak English because of the internet. He like it basically made him learn. I don't know if it was Minecraft necessarily, but the internet. He learned English. Is that true for you, or did you learn it in school? Or yeah, yeah, it was was kind of a 
part thing. I, I had English at school and I think I learned at least the basics there. Yeah. But I, I don't think it's enough the school English, just doing that to really speak English. Maybe you're at an A level after that, if mm -hmm. you're lucky. But um, yeah, I, I think I learned most of the stuff from like just watching English videos all day and reading English stuff. And yeah. because most of the, uh, the bigger Minecraft communities uh, were back in the day in English. So at least in, in the command block and map making scene. So I had to learn English. Right. And so it, it kind of just happened. Yeah. That's cool. Because yeah, your uh, first videos were in German. Yeah. I, I think my first one was in English on this channel, but but my very first videos and some of the earlier videos were in, in German. Mm -hmm. Like some tutorials. I, I think I made one like how to craft the different fireworks stuff. And right. some of this was was my very, my very first very big success with like 100,000 views in two years or something like that. Fewer work <laughs> bow and crafting. How'd that go? How'd that German go? Fewer oh work bow goodness. and crafting. No. Does that work? <laughs> yeah, bow. Yeah, yeah not, not bad. Not Fe <laughs> Feuerwerk bauen slash craften. Bauen <laughs> slash craften. Uh, so, so you changed. Keep practicing. Like you were doing, yeah. you, did you have like an audience back in, in your full German videos uh, at all? Uh, not really, I think. Oh, yeah. I, I had like like 100 subscribers for like the first two years or something like that. So oh, not, wow. not really. But my, I, with my earlier maps, I, I think I got a few viewers, but not like a significant number or something like that. Right. Man, so you, you kept powered, going. Yeah, Go. I was just going to ask that. You powered through for a couple of years with yeah. just like 100 or so subscribers. Yeah, I, I didn't really expect much from the channel, if I have to be honest. I just made like every month a video here or there and yeah. like... Worked worked on maps in the in the meantime and put them out and like some some big bigger German YouTubers back in the day played them and so I got like ten thousand views on this trailer and like five thousand views on this one it was, was a cool time but didn't really expect to get like a viewer base or something like that. So, we we have a wow. word for that. It's very very we call it perseverance. Can you yeah. say perseverance? Perseverance. Oh, he's. Like, <laughs> yeah. I, I I know the words, but my 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 pronunciation is okay. is not not yeah. great. <laughs> Your pronunciation. Perseverance. It's right. fucking funny. Your video. It just has a video of uh, I think it's the one hundred. Thanks for one hundred subscribers. Where you pause it to say, perse 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 perse. Perse How do you say that then, word? Yeah. Then you did the Google Translate <laughs> thing on it. And, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Sorry, I had to poke one of that. But yeah, de definitely no, no, you persevered through that and you showed people how to be successful. I'm not even there yet, man. Very good job. Yeah. yeah. No problem. Now, now, when you were doing those videos, when was that? It was 2011, 2012? Like, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My first channel back in the day was like in, in, in like, I think in May or something, 2011. Mm -hmm. I think I started out with my first channel. My very first video was like playing Snake on YouTube. If you remember back in the day, you had this little loading symbol yeah. in the middle with uh -huh. these little bubbles going around and you could transform them into a snake and run around the screen. And that's yep. got me like my first video. So that was fun. I don't remember that. <laughs> snake? Yeah, you don't mm. remember that, Q? No. Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> that's hilarious. Yeah. So you and recorded so that and uploaded that? Yeah, I made a little tutorial on how, how to get a snake playing. <laughs> wow. <laughs> this was uh, like my first video. Oh, man. <laughs> Great thing. Yeah. I, we, I wonder if anybody, you know, the uh, like the loading screen or the, the 404 running out of memory or whatever, the little dinosaur that you can make jump in Google Chrome. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I wonder if anybody's done any videos with that. What? <laughs> what is surely, this? surely. There's a video of everything. These are <laughs> secrets I did not know about. Oh, I'll show you later, Q. Oh, it's man, fun. Cool. It's good times. Oh, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. Yeah. I love that. I'm so glad to know that about you now. <laughs> we're we're gonna we're gonna go into what the bulk of you're known for. But before we get into that, um, you are actually multi talented because you're a builder too. I'm looking at yeah. these old videos. Like you built these castles and. Like that is not, there's a lot of guys who are great with command blocks. There's a lot of guys who are guys and girls who are great with building and all there's, 
I don't know a lot of people who are great with both. And you have that talent. You started out as a builder. Yeah, yeah. I, I, my, my very first videos were where stuff I built. Um, I, I don't think I'm particularly good at it. I, I, it just makes me a lot of fun to just sit around like hours and placing blocks. No, <laughs> you, no, it is good. Look, you go to Itch's <laughs> Minecraft channel and you see the first video, a time lapse. That looks like a like a really good server build. And yeah. it's dated, so yeah. what you could do... Do you still do builds like that today? Um, I, I think I, I stopped for the most part. I made like one like six years ago or something like that, like another castle. And in between, like smaller things, but but no, not like these gigantic maps with, with like that are like 1,000, 2,000 blocks long and wide and stuff that you see on planet Minecraft. I don't think I could do that at least on my own. So mm. I kind of I've, stopped doing that. <laughs> I mean, you did the, uh, the Death Star. Oh you yeah. did all oh, that building true. by hand, <laughs> right? Like, and that was also incredible. In the interior of that, with everything you built in there, mm. that was good, man. Like you, yeah. <laughs> that wasn't that long ago. How long ago was that? Just yeah. a few months, right? Was, was, uh, Death Star was like six days ago. <laughs> Yeah, but it was like I, I built a thing over like two weeks or something like that. Yeah, it took a while. And, <laughs> I'm sure yeah. it took a while. <laughs> but 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 that build was more of like I would say a time saving measure because uh -huh. at first I pl planned to make like a data pack that could generate a whole uh, Death Star like my planet uh -huh. generator. But then I realized that it would like take forever <laughs> like make, making all that stuff in the middle and and all yeah. this cannon stuff and, and generating these blocks because you can't really automate that process mm. so it i would have to place all that stuff comment per block so i just thought maybe i just should just make a time lapse of it instead and then um create the cannon stuff with command blocks after that and just give it a map download instead of a data pack that generates the whole thing. Well, I mean, it was super cool. It's super impressive. And it, to me, it, it, to me, it makes me agree with Q that you, you are a good builder, man. Like I, I, I appreciate the fact that you are a good builder and a good command block person and also video editor. Your videos are really well made. <laughs> Talent is. Oh, 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 I don't even know how to say it. You just—it's blowing me my mind. Oh, good. Yeah. You. you well, thank you very much. I'm blushing over here. <laughs> good. Oh, okay. No beard and blushing. We now have, have yeah. a second tip to what yep. we look oh, like. Oh God. Will be revealed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The image you get of me after this will be horrific. Oh <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. Uh, I, uh, I I was going to say the first time I think I'd ever heard of you was when I played a map called Asleep by uh, mm -hmm. a couple of guys who were like, they wanted to be like my diversity map. And then they made the Sleep, which was really good. And they used, a, I think your furniture uh, wasn't a mod, though. Oh. It was a... Uh, uh, so was, was a command. It was so a command. command. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And uh, I remember you commented on my YouTube channel. I'm like, whoa, whoa, who's it? Now you're like big, like big shot walking through here. Whoa, guys, big shot. <laughs> well, I was like, well, you actually comment on people's, do you have a, do you still comment on people's channels? Like who yeah, are using your stuff? Uh, sometimes yeah. for the most part nowadays, because some bigger channels just, seem to love taking my my creations and like putting them in, the, in their videos and ignoring my my little text that says by minecraft so i have to leave a little comment down below the video that just <laughs> oh, some, oh, I see. a small percentage of the people know that it's from me so yeah. yeah but yeah yeah also 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 do some other comments on youtube but not not so often anymore i, th yeah. I think since i have been a little bit inactive so i lost a little bit of the no where where the good videos are so yeah <laughs> i know where because they are. they're on your channel yeah. oh. oh thank you <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's that's such a bummer like every single person that we have on this show that is like a map maker or modder or command block or whatever youtubers that like don't credit them and it's like come on come on just give credit to the man. He worked hard on this. You shouldn't have to also work and go leave a comment. <sighs> yeah. I, I, I think that there, there are 
there are quite a number of YouTubers who actually do give appropriate com uh, credit, like they add a yeah. link to your channel and stuff to the map, a link to the map, yeah. maybe even mention you properly in the video. But um, there is always one like one yeah. big YouTuber who, who, who takes everything and just doesn't credit anyone. So I, I don't think we're gonna change that. But yeah. I I think over the years it 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 went a little bit better. It's it's more there are more YouTubers now that give appropriate credit. I yeah. think ah, that's it's, at least in my opinion how I how I I got experience it with my videos. I got I got it for you. Okay. Next video, one, only one command, how to credit a map maker. And then when they play it, it'll put the name up there, right? And you can even put their name on it. Huh? Dude. How about that idea? Right, that maybe spam like a boss bar with my name and in the chat always. Maybe like some signs everywhere. Only one a, command. A, a sound pr soundtrack like it's a Minecraft, it's a Minecraft. <laughs> oh, he <laughs> sings <laughs> too. Okay, sing yeah. it. Oh, oh no, oh no. Beard. <laughs> oh yeah, we're getting the picture oh, here. God. <laughs> it's a Minecraft, it's a Minecraft. Okay, contest That's out there for our horrible. listeners. Write the That's... It's a Minecraft jingle. And uh, yeah, there you oh, go. oh yeah, we'll, there you he'll go. feature it on his every video from now on. Right? <laughs> yeah, it's outro. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> you know what though? But that that could actually be like one of those dumb ideas that like people latch on to and share. You know, like he, I could yeah. see a bunch of creators who see a video of a mod pack like that, and they're like, "Yeah, I'm gonna share this. This is what we need. <laughs> Credit <Yeah>. other creators." <laughs> Could work goes viral, gets you 20 yeah. million views, and you got it here, my friend, on the Void yeah. Frogs podcast. We're gonna it, make it. It could you work like if you famous. do it to a streamer, you could like troll them because they're live. Yeah, mm. and you yeah. could like. I was gonna. There's this one YouTuber who irritated me, and I knew they were gonna play my other maps, and I was gonna put their name, and I was gonna summon Ender Dragons, and destroy the map while they're <laughs> while they're playing it. <laughs> so but they were like uh that's probably too mean yeah yeah <laughs> yeah I, I f that's the problem because i i already thought about adding like small stuff into them into the data packs or maps that oh. would like maybe make it more difficult for certain people who don't really credit often right. but you can't really go overboard because yeah. you won't see the videos after that because if everything goes yeah goes up in flames yeah. they are not going to upload that video or maybe let someone of their team look over the data pack and like fish out where, where the stuff is hidden yeah. so so i thought maybe a good good feature for minecraft data packs would be like a simple encryption that would like encrypt the data packs and then when they are loaded by minecraft itself they would be decrypted so you couldn't really change the stuff in there while mm. it's not running that's a, it would be cool that's a very cool idea do you think that something like that could feasibly be done yeah i i don't know because you would have to create i think a program for for the data pack makers that would uh allow them to encrypt their stuff yeah and i don't know if that's that's too much and you would have to advertise that stuff so everyone knows where to find it and you probably also have to make it so that normal data packs would work as well. I don't know if Mo Mojang would want to add something like that. It was just a little idea. I don't know. Mm. <laughs> that, that could that could have legs to it. I'm I'm gonna bring it up to some people I know and see. You know, get a little conversation going. That's an interesting idea. Oh, I, I, I know. I, I, I like know. The I know. What you think there? Next, it's your Minecraft. How to encrypt a data pack in only one command. In only <laughs> one command. <laughs> right yeah, then if i could do that that would be cool <laughs> okay so <clears throat> speaking of only one command let's go in, love, mm. like the bulk now actually you're breaking out and you're doing these crazy popular videos but for yeah. a long time maybe you still are known for this you are the one command only one command guy yeah which always mm. bugged me but anyway because it's, it's not <laughs> oh, okay it's just not one command it's money many commands but i get it uh, where did yeah, that, where did I, that come I, from? Where you you invented that, or did you get that from somewhere? Or what, no, no, I I think there was one before me. Like, um, there there was a, a tree generator, I think, by JL two five seven nine, who made it like in one point seven, I think, right. like a few months before my very first one. Hmm. And I I got into the one command thing back when um, a YouTuber called Squirt Dude. 
Squirt I, I don't know if you know him. Yeah, oh, I know him. No. We talked. Squirt Dude. Yeah. He's gone. Yeah, he what is he doing now. Yeah, he hasn't been active for, for a while now, but he made, uh, I don't know if, what, if it was for a subscriber special. Mm. He made a one command contest where you would like to submit your stuff where um, you would want to make the coolest thing with just a single command. And I thought of making this little machine that would generate more stuff. Back in the day, I don't think there were, besides the tree generator, there were any other command machines right. that did stuff like that. But yeah, that's that's how I got into into one commands. And after that, I just continued doing that for like three years. So, so for <laughs> anybody who doesn't understand, uh, I'm going to try to give a layman's term. You tell me if I'm correct. It spawns a command and then a falling redstone block and a falling command block and continuously continuously and then creates it all or is that incorrect yeah at, at the beginning i used falling sand or falling block blocks right. entities and yeah yeah so they would just pile up and then at the end be removed right yeah and but i i think this method method doesn't work anymore oh no after that we had to had to switch to this these minecart uh, command block minecarts and use them instead mm -hmm. Yeah, and you just like spawn like 200 minecarts, command block minecarts with, with single commands in them, <laughs> which you would spawn them all riding on top of each other. They would <laughs> land on like a powered rail and activate and each of them would spawn another block, like a command block for the machine, okay. the machine itself. And after that, they would all get killed and you would have the machine remaining in your world. So, oh. yeah. And then I'm you changed it when they came out with the with the uh, purple and green <laughs> command blocks. Yeah, I, I I don't even know when. Do uh, you mean when when the falling block and command block minecart when they changed the command block minecart? Well, I the ones that I've seen, like uh, maybe use functions now, but the ones that I saw for a, a long time have that big box and all the chain command blocks. Mm. And that so that's a different method, though, right? Yeah, not not for the generation, but oh. for the machine itself. I oh, think. For yeah, oh. yeah be before the repeating on chain command blocks, we used uh, like a normal fill clock would replace like every tick, like redstone and air, yeah. Yeah. continuously, and would power all command blocks around it, and you would have to place them in a certain order, right. depending on where, like on. I don't know which one would power first, like one, I think in the south, placed in the south or something like that, would power first and then upwards. And then you would place them so in, in, in order. Mm -hmm. And yeah, the redstone clock would power the whole thing. And after that, we just used the repeating command block at the beginning. Right. And then just a chain of chain command blocks that was a bit easier in the end. And I think less laggy. <laughs> <laughs> but how... I, I didn't miss how you said how are you how are you actually creating that those chain command blocks yeah it's just just like uh before we would just uh have in each minecart right uh, a single command like set block uh chain command block over there at this this coordinate coordinates with a command in there okay and we would have like 200 of these uh, minecarts mm -hmm. and they, they would all place a single command block in the machine <laughs> And they're powered by a powered rail. All of yeah, the, the minecarts would be powered by, they would be spawned on a, a powered rail, fall down on it, and yeah. then at the end get killed. <laughs> How did somebody even come up? That's what blows my mind. I, I get that it like, yeah, it's pretty complicated and like pretty cool to make, but did you come up with that idea to begin with? I'm like, what? Where? Just yeah. at my, my top of my head's almost coming off by being have a brain blow up. When yeah. it's, it's like, like an incremental process at the end, at the beginning, I think my very first one was just like I spawned a tower of command blocks right. and then just a row of redstone blocks inside. <laughs> so you would have this nice long tower in your world. <laughs> <laughs> that was the machine. But you would, would make improvements every command. Like mm. after that, I maybe removed the tower and after that, I wouldn't just place like a redstone clock and stuff like that, but a real real machine instead of like a redstone repeater that would power stuff i don't know yeah so so you would get better every, every command block a, a couple yeah. years ago 
when I I first tried one of those only one command and I got the machine. So I like I, I got it. I got the only one command. I went into my world. I, I ran the command and the machine appeared in my world. And I was amazed. I was blown <laughs> away just by seeing the machine in my world. And I was just happy with that. I didn't know what to do after that. I, I was just satisfied. Uh, and then I, I don't think I ever actually got it to work. I, I think I didn't pay attention oh. to the tutorial or something. Yeah. But yeah, I had this yeah. machine in my world and I was just like, this is so cool. <laughs> just Yeah, dude. dude. The generation was a very quick thing, but the problem is that you only had like uh, 32,000 characters or something like yeah. that oh, yeah, to yeah. put all your stuff into that. So you couldn't really add a cool method of drafting and stuff like that. You couldn't really add a cool tutorial that yeah. explains well, because there was no space if you wanted to actually add some features into the machine. After you had like four features, there was no space for anything else. So right. that was yeah. a little bit of a bummer. So you had to watch the videos to know what was going on with each command but <laughs> so well, so I'm, do you count a data pack as only one command because you can put it all in, no. in a function file right you know you count that i mean it's 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 a uh, zero zero one. only zero, zero, zero commands. Commands. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a good name yeah. <laughs> only yeah. zero commands um, yeah i i don't think it's the same because you uh first of all you don't have a command yeah <laughs> you don't just go to a website and the fun was with one command that you could go to a website and just copy a command and put it in your world. Now with the data packs and functions, you have to download a file. Yeah. yeah. Just like with, with what you would do with a mod, just that it's easier to install. But still, it's not really the same. It's You can add a, add a lot more features into it. That's cool and all, but it's... it's yeah, it's you can... Now that you add, can add resource packs into the data packs, it's kind of like... A, worse mod <laughs> almost yeah. because you could technically do most of the things mods do but it just takes so much more time it's more laggy and mm -hmm. yeah so yeah. do you do you prefer the data packs and stuff like working with those or is it more fun to do the only one command stuff yeah um i do think that working in in uh, data packs is a lot easier mm -hmm. because you just have your text editor open and you can have like two files yeah. inside each other and write all your commands in. And you can like, if you have programming experience, you can create little programs that generate function files for you. If you want yeah. to like, I don't know, have something that has to target every angle of an entity, you could write something like that easily. You don't have to type every one of these commands out by hand. Yeah, that's cool. And yeah, it's 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 a and you can do a lot more things as well. Like you can have these loot tables and resource packs and all that stuff. So working creating one commands was yeah, it was a challenge at times. <laughs> yeah. You made a generator or, or was that Garetto made a generator for it? Yeah, uh, Mr. Mr. Garetto made like an online generator. Right. But I I, I never used that one. Oh no. No, I always wrote my stuff myself because okay. um, you like pain. If you have these, <laughs> yeah, you know, it's right. Because I enjoy a challenge. <laughs> no, it was more of a efficiency reason because yeah. uh, with these standardized things, you can you have less even less space because you don't have control over how your machine is built. Yeah, you don't have control right. over how it's placed and everything. You can add your own features to your machines that aren't possible with these uh, generators. So it was easier to use these generators, but you could get more done if you did it by hand. Right. And I, I didn't write every machine by hand itself, but I, for every version, I wrote a machine template. So like a text file with, with, with the main structure of the machine. And then I would just, for every command, write the single commands in the machine. And then just put, paste them into the template. So, gotcha. It, it I, was similar, but <laughs> it, <laughs> I, 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 I'm going to do this. To, just write all to these. Me, <laughs> <laughs> to me, I, I mean, that makes sense uh, to me. Like, because I've done web development for years, and there's always been, mm -hmm. you know, little website generators and things like that, template stuff. And like for me, it, it, 
it's just easier for me to write it myself. You know, like mm. I can just write it myself because I know exactly how I want it to be formatted and structured and everything. So that that makes sense to me, even if I don't know a single thing about commands or functions or anything I could learn. I just haven't done it yet. Uh, so, you know, you're smarter than me, but we're I, I connect with. you. Oh, I'm, oh I'm, I just I, you're the guy who could do it. Like I get these questions all the time. Diversity for when? Well, when it's in Minecraft makes. Uh, one command only generate diversity for it will happen <laughs> right buddy yeah yeah okay so never <laughs> never <laughs> probably uh, you have right. created some really cool generators though we mentioned um, yeah the castle because you built castles as well but also like you have yeah. just that castle generator which is incredible mm. uh and also, like, oh, the, the one thing I wanted to mention, that castle generator, I thought it was so cool that not only did you have this ability to generate a castle, which is neat in the world, but also you had the individual assets, like a tower or a wall mm. or, you know, whatever. Like, you had those individual assets in the same uh, data pack, right? And you could generate each of those individually to create your own castle if you wanted to. Like your, your attention to detail on that was very impressive to me, but so you did the, the castle generator, you've done tree generator, uh, yeah. planet generator. What else? Q, was there something else? Yeah. The planet one is blew my mind. Yeah. Yeah. What, what'd you say, yeah. Q? I said the planet one just blew my mind. I, that was, yeah. I it, mainly because I don't know how you do the spheres, um, Man, if anybody's out there and has not actually seen these videos, definitely check the links that are in whatever show notes or description. Because yeah. the planet generator was the video that just, I think I sent a message to Stephen. Like, this guy is yeah. incredible. I That's exactly not, what he said. I couldn't yeah. believe. Uh, and I, I've been a command, so I understand some of the stuff. But like making the spheres and stuff and then the vegetation on the top. How in the world do you... I want to yeah. know how you, everything you do. How do you do it, man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I even ex explained the, the method I used there in the comments, and also in I, I used a similar method in, in my new Death Star video. It's basically these you this carrot notation. You have this instead of the tildes yeah. in the command blocks for the co coordinates. Yeah. You would use the carrots, which are relative to where an entity is looking. Right. For example, if you would use like. If you would have a player looking like 55 degrees upwards, yeah. you would then have in the carrot notation for the C, uh, Z coordinate, uh, you would like write there a five, and then it would place a block, five blocks away from where the player is looking. So 55 right. degrees upwards, five blocks away. Yeah. So which you could use that then to rotate an armor stand's head around. And always place five blocks away or like a hundred blocks away for a big sphere, mm. a block, slowly uh, rotate it around and it would then pretty much create, generate a sphere if you know, uh, if you understand what I talked about. Yes. I don't know if I explained it well. Yeah, well, no. I, I had to use that kind of method in the ma in my map, but I could never get it to, to be fine. Like, I think I, I couldn't get it to do a fine... Uh, Rotating. I had I had yeah. really wide rotating. So yeah. you on your planet you have like layers. It's just the core and then it builds and it looks so yeah. cool when it builds too. That's the really nice thing. Yeah. 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 The problem with that method is that once you go too far away, place blocks too far away, you have to make like very small <laughs> teleportation uh, for each rotation change. Because if you don't do that, like there will be a like here, here a hole there, and there's stuff missing because the distance you're teleporting and rotating is just too high. Right. And yeah. 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 yeah the the mind. way that I think about it, so I understand how you're describing it, but when it comes to actually going into the game and trying to do these sorts of things, the way that I imagine it is that you are a you're genius. building a house, right? <laughs> You're building a house and the house is, you're holding it up. You have to hold the house while you're building it and it's invisible 
and you're trying to add on extra rooms onto the house at the same time. <laughs> and in my mind, it's like the moment that somebody says anything else to you, a number or a word or it, you get distracted. <laughs> the whole thing comes crashing down around you. Like, and you have to start like everything that you describe makes sense theoretically, but actually doing it just sounds like impossible to me. I just, it's hard, man, but I, I I appreciate the fact that you just explained it so well. You did explain it very well. Yeah, oh, uh, actually, speaking of genius house, whatever, I want to settle this little... Uh, we had a, uh, another guest, uh, Mackestein, which I believe you're friends with. Yeah, you guys, you, are, guys, you guys have known each other for years, right? You're both from Germany. You guys... No, nah, I... Uh, Mackenstein is from Austria. Yeah. So oh, don't you remember? Austria, yeah, I was yeah, just gonna. Right, right. He speaks speak German, German though. though. He speaks German though. Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Mackenstein. Anyway, what I was gonna say was, I'm gonna leave now. He, I don't know if maybe it was a little battle, <laughs> but you guys had uh, the epic way to turn on a lamp and the epic way to open a door. Yeah. Like, settle this now. Who who's got the more epic way? Come on, do it. Me naturally. Yes, <laughs> confidence. <laughs> no, no, I, I think both videos were, were great. <laughs> no, no, patting myself on the back there, but um, yeah. he naturally did it first. Yeah. and there were also some some other videos. Like yeah. I think back in the day, uh, like 2012 or 2011, there were. I don't even remember the crafted movie. I think made like two videos right. with very basic redstone before that opening like a door with a very Ruben Goldberg like right. way yep. yeah. very convoluted yeah and yeah I, I kind of messed up in that video because hmm. I, I forgot to to thread it McMagistein in the, in the description uh -oh. and yeah <laughs> yeah Can, yeah he was saying but, off camera but, how he, he wasn't he couldn't forgive you for he'd never forget that and he wasn't yeah I, I know it was it was horrible <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm, a, I'm a bad bad human being yeah. I, but but I fixed it now and and the good thing is, it didn't get many views till I fixed it. So after I fixed it, the the, the YouTube algorithm aligned and it got some views. <laughs> and hopefully, like Marcus Stein got some views as well. See so. now that <laughs> you do actually deleted the video and then re-uploaded one. Is that what you're saying? No, no, <laughs> I, I I changed the description. Oh, you changed. And, it. Okay, all right. And put I put see, a link to, to his video. So yeah, that that was. Yeah, he he's happy to give. Uh, Mackie credit, but not to delete the video and re upload. I was gonna say that is dedication to a friendship right there. I I'm actually going yeah. to delete all the Void Frog videos after this just to show my friendship. Okay. Yep. Yep. We'll see. Which one? Which one would be? Which one would be your your favorite of all the data packs and one box commands? Which one would be your personal favorite that you made? Uh. Um, the data packs among commands. Yeah, all, all your all your concepts and stuff. Yeah, I'm just scrolling through them <laughs> on another tab here, and mm, I would say, yeah, may maybe I quite like my my stuff that generates things. Mm -hmm. I, I loved my very first one, the village generator, which was quite cool. Yeah, mm. though a bit dated looking at it now, but yeah, I hmm, yeah. I would say the planet generator and the furniture ones are yeah. pretty good. Yeah. And I also love the the space laser I did like in 112, version 112, mm. which, which had like this cool block animation where Dude, after firing sick. you would <laughs> the whole whole cannon was made up of little armor stands holding blocks as the heads. And it was was very cool, all this stuff animated because it was was a bit difficult to get at all in one command, but Turned out great, I think. You Man. can do it. If anyone can do Seriously. it, it's, it's your Minecraft. That was that that might be one of my favorite things that I've seen. Like that the little tiny animations, the way that the laser like kind of expands and contracts a little bit when it's activated. I was absolutely blown away by that. Where the sides like turn red. Ah, dude, that that was sick. That was sick. He, he's fanboying. He's I'm, geeking out. Yes, I love I you. Am. I I'm love sorry. your stuff. I'm sorry. That, that was that was seriously a very, yeah. very, very cool thing. Hey, I had a question actually about the 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 generator stuff. You know, um, 
the new jigsaw blocks in what, when did those come out? 1.14, I think. Um, do you, there's really no use for those yet. As far as I can tell, do you think that those, yeah. Do you, you guys know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Jigsaw blocks. They, they, uh, when you're doing a village generation, they decide what room is going somewhere. I think something like that. Exactly. Yeah. So they have the little jigsaw like pieces essentially, and it connects. So you'll have a path with like three different little jigsaw nodes, I guess you would call them. And then the other, you know, a building, a temple, whatever will attach onto that. You know what I'm referring to, Itja? Yeah, I just Googled it in the background. I haven't heard of that before. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm totally aware of that. Yep, yep. They, 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 yeah, yeah, I know them. Yeah. I've used them in Africa. <laughs> love them, love them. Well, that's, that's great. That's really interesting. I'm fascinated by that because they really don't have a use yet. So if you have found a mm. use for them, uh, I would love to hear it. No, no. Uh, but, but I may look into them. Maybe they are. Yeah, uh, I would love they have some some secret. I I think it would be cool if there could be a use to for generating things randomly. Yeah. You know, procedurally generated random generation. Because um, I mm. know with like your your planet generator, uh, and maybe your your castle generator. Maybe all of maybe all of your generators. You can correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but they do. Like the planet generator, the core and everything is all the same from one planet to the next. They're all the same, yeah. right? Yeah, there, there are some difference. For example, um, there are cave systems in the planet which are similar, but not exactly because I spawn like invisible bats oh. after the planet is generated Ooh. inside. And then like destroy blocks around yeah, yeah. them and they fly up or down. I teleport them around a little bit. And so I get like slightly random caves oh. and... For the trees on top, I use like the spread players yeah. command to uh, randomly place the trees on there. Yeah, it's it's slightly random. I mean, the core is the same, but yeah. uh, it's, it's hard to do, do co- that completely random because it would take Listen like forever. It. Yeah. Listen to yeah, Stifler. Yeah, sure. uh, you need to actually make this a little bit better and change this in here so <laughs> no, that's that I'm a happy friend boy. Yeah, yeah, I I'm don't the, know. I'm just, that's not what I'm saying. That's not what I'm saying. <laughs> what I'm saying is jigsaw blocks to me yeah. could be a big opportunity if they get some functionality that we can actually use with like you know commands and stuff um to it's do it's just like random. i don't need jigsaw blocks i am yeah. a jigsaw block yeah it's just awesome man it's just awesome it's just awesome <laughs> hey oh we got a few minutes left before we move into your favorite part um mm-hmm. So okay. <laughs> uh, we still got tons of stuff on the list, but we're not going to get into everything. Um, so now you're doing these, well, I'm going to say viral videos. You got massive million, must feel awesome to have a million views on a video, but yeah. is that kind of like the direction you're going to go with your channel? Or are you still going to do one block commands um, or what's going on? Or one? Yeah. Well, well, one block commands, I didn't do like one for like two years, I think. Oh, okay. One year, one and a half year. But I think I will continue doing like data pack stuff yeah. and map map downloads. Like my 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 latest this time lapse dev star one is also a map download, so you can check it out yourself. But um, yeah, I think I will continue doing that because these comparison videos. Yeah. There's only so much stuff that you can compare <laughs> in Minecraft <laughs> before you are out of ideas. So that's not really you could, sustainable. You could do for a Minecrafter map maker height comparisons and like have pictures of all of us <laughs> go to the hot, tallest guy yeah if you provide them why not yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. okay those uh yeah, but then no 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 cheating no no getting yourself i'll, one sh- I'll do photoshop and, and <laughs> squish myself again and make myself taller six foot ten <laughs> You know, <laughs> hmm. those those comparison videos are cool. And uh, OK, so at the end of the 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 chance video, I don't really want to spoil it, but you guys go watch it. But mm-hmm. at the end of the chance video, you show a an, an entity, a chance of spawning a specific type of entity. OK, mm. you just spoiled it. No, I didn't. Know you guys entity. go watch it. Go see what type of entity this is, because it's actually mm. interesting. All right. Mm. Did you just make that up, or is that actually the number? Because <laughs> that, that was like, I'm calling you out. You lied. You made it up, didn't you? 
<laughs> I've never heard yeah, of someone like... Chance to spawn higher, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> well, according to my comments, there are like 1,000 people that had this specific entity spawn in their world. Like, yeah, true. Really? <laughs> true. But, yeah, I, I, I think some of them may have just written that huh. and lied. Oh. I, I don't want to accuse anything, <laughs> but... Uh, after calculating the chance, it's kind of unlikely that so many people <laughs> had this thing spawn in their world. Yeah. And I'm, I'm, I'm not entirely sure if it even is possible because the number might be <gasps> too high or low to actually be possibly generated by Minecraft. I'm, I'm not one of these guys who <coughs> looks directly into the code yep. itself. You I just, just up on use the spot. like sources. Okay. Or <laughs> 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 I, I, I just... Look up sources online yeah. and see what are the chances for certain things happening. Yeah. And then I just use some basic maths and yeah. <laughs> calculate yeah. them together. And yeah, I, I got this chance. I could probably have made it even more rarer with some other stuff like it can break doors and it has high enchantments, <laughs> not just the basic Part ones two. and stuff like that. Yeah. There yeah. You go. <laughs> I think, think like Raiga V, I don't know if you know this channel, which makes like uh, a lot of these comparison videos. Okay. Yeah. He also had one about gaming. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. And he had one uh, where he also had such a very specific rare entity in, the in his comparison. And his was like a lot rarer than mine because he had like all these specific other parameters that he added uh -huh. to it. And I also found a Reddit thread where he copied the the number from <laughs> so oh, but um, I yeah see how it is. but also un un under these reddit threads there are a lot of discussions about if it's even possible for the game to spawn this stuff and right. if the calculations are even correct because it seems like minecraft wiki and similar have some inconsistencies for this stuff so mm. not everything is is that so clear so there is a little bit of wiggle room for stuff like this but so then, uh, Technically, then the next video is comparison of truth of these statistics. Yeah, which yeah. one's real? <laughs> the likelihood that they're true. <laughs> now, I'm truth checker. I'm pretty Wait. sure that the number that you gave is like the 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 number is so large. It's if I know the numbers correctly in my head, if I remember correctly, one hundred fifty-three trillion. Or it's larger like than than the number of particles atoms in the known universe like if the number is that large and it's like okay that's a yeah, little bit could, ridiculous yeah it, it could could be i think it was like higher than two times one and two times ten uh to 64 i don't know how to say it in english yeah but, yeah yeah uh exponent 64 and yeah it was was, was a big number <laughs> yeah let's see I'm, I'm just looking up real quick uh, the it is estimated that there are on the low end ten to the power of seventy eight atoms in yeah. the known universe. So you're like That's right it? there. That's all there is. Yeah, ten to the power Jeez. of seventy eight atoms. That's lame. Yeah. Mm. So you might yeah. you atoms might be are right lame. There. They are. They are. I mean, technically, the, the the chance should be possible, as far as I could research it. Mm. But I don't know. For sure, hundred yeah. percent. But I still put it in the video because <laughs> <laughs> just just didn't want want to have the the same world twice thing as the top one. Right. Just because. Okay. Well, if anybody out there has seen this this entity, go watch this video. Look yep. and see if you get the entity. If you get it in your world, mm -hmm. let us know, and we will. Uh, I don't know. We'll give you a high five emoji or something on the line. <laughs> Yeah. All right, one la one last question. We have been saving this one for last before we get into yep. you know what's coming next. Okay, <clears throat> you've done a lot of boss battles. Mm -hmm. You've done uh, yeah. some of the Mojang developers. You've done uh, the Demon Lord, you know. You think of all yeah. your boss battles in your head, and they're going into a battle arena, and they're all battling okay. each other. Mm -hmm. Who is going to be the one who survives in the end yeah it's it's difficult because first of all it would probably break the world apart because it would <laughs> yeah, be so lucky but <laughs> <laughs> but um yeah i think probably some of the the bosses 
if they could attack each other, some of the bosses with the phases, like the Hero Prime boss or the Entity 303 boss, would probably come out on top Ooh. because they would just stay in their first phase. No one could reach them. Yeah. And stuff like that. Yeah. So, yeah. He's it's, it's a little looking. bit difficult to combine. Yeah. 303. I, I'm, I, you know, I'm, I would, I, Personally, I'd I'd venture to guess three hundred three would would win. <laughs> oh, yeah, you say that now. He's like before we recorded. He's like that's the one that he definitely won't pick out of all. Of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but but now looking at it, probably the notch boss because he could just change the game code and everything would work in his favor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you know, I that's exactly what I was saying. The notch boss totally, yeah, totally would win. <laughs> Totally would win. Okay. B three hundred three, easy. <laughs> Man, these are like you got so many cool videos. Okay, all right. You've seen our show before, Itcha. You oh, are yeah. a fan. <laughs> it is now time for Rabbit Fire. Rabbit Fire. First zero out of five. <laughs> no, no, no. We're not doing that yet. We're not doing that yet. We're just doing the fun round. We'll get okay. into the okay. Trivia after. All right. Okay. So the Rabbit Fire. If people haven't seen these before, this is where we just. We already spent an hour talking to our guests, but these are more <laughs> like goofy questions. I can put you on the spot. Uh, and uh, there's five of them, and we're just going to kind of like expect the most perfect mm-hmm. answer from you. Yep. And we used to call it yeah, rapid fire, cool. but we took too long, so I call it rabid fire now. Yeah. It's and rabid, last yeah. week we called it rabbit fire. So if you have another name for this, put it in the comments. <laughs> All right. You ready? Okay. Yeah. Question number one. If you could watch any celebrity play one of your maps or play one of your data packs, who would it be? Hmm. It's, that's maybe it's, it's a bit of a generic answer, but I would probably pick Notch and just see what oh, things fight about. himself. What? <laughs> yeah, that would be yeah. A, that would be interesting. Yeah. But, but just just what to see or any any of 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 the developers. In, at Mojang, Not, what they see, what what they think about. about has any of them played, played, because, seen it, or played it? You know, no, probably not. I I, I don't think so. I, I didn't see any one of them Q. actually playing, or I I don't even know if they, they even know about Mojang. <laughs> you're listening. Stuff. Fight yourselves. Come on, get over <laughs> here. <laughs> Q, we need to make this man's dreams come true. That's right. Next time we get a Mojang dev on here. It you know Yens or anybody I don't care get them on here we need to tell them like we're gonna switch out the you trivia need to fight for yourself for Edge of Minecraft themselves yep He's... Dude, that'll be the whole episode <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, all right question number two rapid fire question number two if you could live any this is a bad, this is poorly phrased. If you, you just can't read, okay? Anywhere, anywhere in time. I think anywhere, that should just be. Anywhere if you could live time. any time, if you could live any yeah. time, what time would you go to? Yeah. yeah. I, I would probably not go into the past because it might have <laughs> been fun in certain professions, but overall it was probably a worse experience. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I do quite like modern medicine. Mm. Yeah. I wouldn't mind it being like 30 years into the future. Okay. We might even live like 200 years or something like that. If they, when everybody if we, died off from the zombie apocalypse. That's what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I do hope not that, <laughs> I do hope that, not. that such a thing happens. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. well, well I, I think besides some concerns about certain governments and privacy and stuff like that getting worse overall. I think just having better medicine and robots getting better so we have uh, actually capacities to to help people more would probably be, so I would probably take like 20, 30 years from now would be a good time. Anywhere after that and we would get into space exploration and I'm not such a big sci-fi fan. So. I've seen enough Hollywood <laughs> leave, documentaries leave, leave that I know bit. robots are going to kill us in the future. Oh my goodness. Those aren't yeah. documentaries, Q. Those are just Were you movies. there? You weren't there in the future. Yeah. Okay, are, question that's, number that's, three. That, that's such a good answer, though. I really like that answer. Well, here, I'm waiting. For, this is question number three. <clears throat> Picture 
a hot dog, or maybe in German you say schnitzel, oh. in your mind. <laughs> no. Uh, hot dogs. Uh, okay. I don't think a schnitzel's my friend. Oh, okay. So, yeah. so bratwurst? We call them hot dogs. Yeah. <laughs> just hot All dogs. right. The question brat, is: Bratwurst is something what? completely different. Okay. I don't know German, but the question yeah. is: Is a hot dog a sandwich? Ah, uh, just just on the top of the top of my head, I would say no. But oh. I I could be wrong because. Maybe it's it's not really two slices of bread. I think so. That's a good that, isn't, isn't that in the de- definition of a sandwich? I, I think you might be right. That's a good point. Could be. Hmm. Maybe if you put too much pressure on your knife and cut through the hole. So basically, thing, you just have to cut the so bottom of the bun, and it's a sandwich. That yeah. is the one criteria. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Right. I don't know. Okay. Go ahead. Next. Question, don't let please. this keep you up at night. <laughs> I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> um, question rapid fire. Question number four. Um, do you like uh, superheroes? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I watch some of the movies. I'm not really a big comic book fan. But okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, with the uh, okay. with the movies, all right. Mm-hmm. Who is the best Batman actor? Yeah, that's a good question because I, I I saw the series Gotham. I don't know if if you watched that. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh, Gotham uh, the series. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I, I I don't actually know the name of the actor, but I thought it was wasn't a bad performance. I also liked the Christopher Nolan movies, and I yeah, the, I didn't really see any other Batman movies now no. that I think about it. I, I think think he appeared for like three seconds in Suicide Squad. So yeah, okay. Yeah, I I can only say it isn't Ben Affleck. So. <laughs> Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> you're going Poor with ben the Affleck. boy. Sorry, ben. The child actor is what you're going with. I did yeah, not expect uh, that at all. I like yeah, the series like a lot, actually. This that is mm. a that is a good series. Uh, I haven't kept up with it recently. I stopped watching it at like season two, the end of season two. But have you seen it, Q? Hmm. I refused. So anyway, uh, <clears throat> question <laughs> number five. All right. We already know this is going to work with you because you alluded to this uh, yep. earlier in the podcast. Yep. Okay. Now, here's the scenario. There's an alien invasion threatening to destroy the world. The aliens dun, have dun, met dun. with the prime minister of Germany, of all places, and has okay. appointed you in your Minecraft as the ambassador for the world. You have one okay. chance to save all of humanity. And the only way to save it is the aliens are demanding you sing karaoke. What song are you going to choose? Oh, God. <laughs> Not piling on the pressure there. <laughs> okay. All of humanity mm. is at stake with your karaoke. Yep. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I, that's, that's, that's a good question. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hmm. Maybe, maybe I, I actually do quite like rock and metal, mm. but I wouldn't say that might. I would say that might not be a good they choice. Might, for, they, they might bring out their like, guns. That, <laughs> their their lasers. Yeah. <laughs> Too loud. <laughs> also, also. Some some pop song might be a bit generic. Mm-hmm. So, um, do you, uh, you do know the movie Treasure Planet? Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, do you know the title song? I, I, um, I don't I, know the well, title why don't song. You, why don't you sing it for why us? Why don't you sing it? So the yeah, that's, that's the problem. Sing it. <laughs> I read or not? Oh, come on, the aliens are waiting. <laughs> The aliens so the, are so, gonna so you're going with the Treasure someone. Planet theme song. Is that what you're saying? Let me quickly Google, Let's go and Google it. Don't. I, I did. I had. I, I, think, I had, think had the no idea is, where this answer was going to go, and I am actually very, um, very impressed and interested. Yeah, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm still here. The, the song is called "I'm Still Here." And I'm, I'm still like, here. John, it was Jim's theme, and John, John. Oh God. 
that's like a Scandinavian name, like John Ress. <laughs> Ress. There, there are too many C's in that right. name. That's, that's <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna listen yeah. to that after this and stay That's like, right. hmm, yeah. I can imagine you singing it and the aliens completely being at peace. Uh, yep. Yeah, I'm, I mean that song would probably be yeah. okay. It's like I'm still here. It's not really a pop yeah. song, but but uh, an emotional yeah. song, so it would probably fit for the occasion. I like yeah. it. <laughs> I, I'm, uh, I'm very you, content with that answer. All you idiots. And even besides that, it's a great song. So check it out. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All you uh, Idja fans out there, I got a call for you, all right? I want you to record yourselves singing this song, Oh no! <laughs> all right, and put it online so we can see all of you guys singing this song for Idja, all right? Give it your best it. shot. Oh, no. Save us from the aliens. <laughs> and uh, Ellie Beatmaker, he'll be the one to determine you're if going, the aliens would like it or not. All We're right? just volunteering <laughs> all of our past guests. <laughs> Helen is going to bring a memo on the song to Moje. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> uh, there we go. Very good. Rabbit fire. Good over. job. Good job. Oh, God. <laughs> good job. Hey, you did well. It's time for me to embarrass <laughs> myself. I loved it. Get ready now, for it. Yeah. The oh, Void yeah, Frogs trivia, my good sir. It is time. Yes. Okay. It Hot is seat. time. Are you um, sweating? I'm not ready. Yeah, okay, yeah, very so much. blushing, sweating, no mm -hmm. beard, no sings, beard. four Insect things eyes. we found out. Get those drawings in. Get them in. In the comments. <laughs> Draw in the comments. And he's six foot ten. What would that be? Two meters? I don't know. What I Ooh, Yeah, probably above two meters. Up. 72 inches, I think. 130 centimeters or so. I don't know. Anyway, Void Frogs trivia. <laughs> Let's do this. Uh, here's how it goes. We have a, uh, a theme for the Void Frogs trivia. We have five questions, and with each of those five questions, I have a timer in my head. You, sir, have an, a, an opportunity here to get all five of those questions correct, and depending on the number of questions that you get correct... I'll give you a certificate. Isn't that exciting? Yeah. Yeah. Great. It's great. Um, <laughs> so we are going to run through these. I, I want you to know the pressure is on for you to get a perfect score. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No one's got a perfect score and I, yet. And it could I be believe, you. Yeah. And no, I will probably disappoint. Come on. <laughs> I believe in you. Oh, God. Yes. yes. Okay. I bet with... With trivia on top of the, me. The winner of this, whoever gets a perfect score, the ultimate prize is we trade YouTube channels with them. So you don't want to yeah. let us down. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it sounds, sounds good. Big win. <laughs> Big win there. <laughs> okay. So the theme for today is, uh, it's just awesome. IJA. That's yeah. our theme for today. Oh, yeah. Okay. Get ready. IJA <laughs> trivia. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Here's question number one. Name an item, any item in Minecraft that starts with the letter I. I. Mm. Without Googling. I, yeah, ice. 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 <laughs> Does it count? As an as ice block item. Ice block. Does it yeah, count? You could say, good Very job. Good. We good would also job. accept you iron got... ore. Iron ingot, okay. yeah, and, and item frame, iron hole, yep. iron sword, yep. sword. Yep. Yeah. All right, all that. one Good to job. one. Hey. Yeah, so just you know, now you know you're Pressure's on a roll. On. Everything's fine. Yeah, number two. Q. Okay, number since two. you're such a huge comic book fan, like you just said, huge. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Have oh, you ever god. heard of Spider Man? Okay. Uh, yeah. He has a secret identity, don't tell anyone, named Peter Parker. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> Peter worked as a photographer at this place called the Daily Bugles, a newspaper place. It was in the movies. Uh, he had yeah. a boss who was yeah. hilarious named J. Jonah Jameson. Okay? What does the J stand for? Uh, that's, yeah, I, I that's I don't know. I, I can just could just guess. Like, Go for it. Hmm. Jonathan? I don't know. No, probably not. Looking. <laughs> hmm. 
What did you say at first? Jonathan? I, I only heard the first syllable. What was it? Oh, oh John. yeah! Good oh, job! John nice. is correct! <laughs> Very good! I didn't know I'm such Two a good Spider-Man fan. <laughs> <laughs> All those years of reading Spider-Man comics <laughs> comes in handy. Comes in handy. Uh, <laughs> good job. All right, you're two for two. Question number three. IJA trivia. Because we, uh, yes, of IJA Void Frogs trivia. We know you. Uh, we you like Star Wars because you built mm-hmm. a Death Star. Yeah. yeah. In the movies, the original movies, after the Death Star was revealed. To Princess Leia. The Hmm. mega weapon's power was put on full display. Yeah. On and with the target of which planet that begins with the letter A. Hopefully I'm not going to embarrass myself. Was was it Alta? Yes! Yeah! Yes! Yes! Good. It's like the only na- planet name I know. You're doing oh. great here. Awesome. Three for three. You oh. are on your way to great Man. things, sir. You are on your way to yeah. running the Void Frogs podcast channel. You Can't are that wait. much closer. What an honor. Can't wait. Okay. <laughs> Can only get worse from you. <laughs> well, hey, this is a little more up your alley, this question number four, okay? okay. All right. The first three letters in your name, I, J, A. Yes. Only one of those letters is the first letter of a Minecraft command. And there's only one command that has that letter. Yeah. Uh, What command is it? That's the impulse command block. The what? what? Impulse. Impulse command block. Input. The I. Impulse. Impulse. No, 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 no. Should no, I no, write no, no. it out? A command that you write, like slash teleport, slash. Oh, oh, oh not a command yeah, block. Command. Ah, so, a command. Uh, okay. There's, you know, oh, 30 commands or uh, something like that. There's only one that has an uh, I, a J, or an A. Then I, a J, or an A. As its first letter. Oh, God. Uh, huh. Come on, can't command expert. Yes. You got this. Do I? I I believe in you. I'm going to be so so embarrassed after that, but uh, that that, there was no command action bar, right? There was only boss bar. Um, I'm gonna have to start counting down in a moment. uh, Come on! Oh no! (laughs) Oh no! Yeah, we're was was there a joint command? The what? No. Was there a joint command in Bedrock Life? No. We're talking We're job. We're going to have to advance on mm-hmm. to the next question. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. The last man. guess you want yeah, to give I, a last I, I guess. I can't can't think of it. We get what? we could give him Yeah, yeah. We give him the letter and he can have a half a point if he gets it right. Okay. No, no, because we already promised uh, McMackishstein oh, yeah. that right. he would be the only yeah, one the with only half, half points. Point. Oh, so right. we'll give you three quarters of a point. How about that? Woo! <laughs> okay. Okay, I would say so, five sevenths of a point. How about two? How about two? How about one third? You get one third of a point because we're one giving you the point. letter. Okay. okay. Ready? Hmm. Yeah, it's good. Q. That's good. Okay, you give up on the. Uh, you don't know what it is. Starts yeah. with an A. Yeah, A. Advancement. Hey, oh, there we point go. three. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. I oh, thought no. you totally would have got that one. <laughs> uh, uh, oh god! Yeah, yeah. It's, I was a, bit, a little bit inactive, and they added like advancement. I think I didn't use yeah. it very much. Right. I only used it like in one block to reset my advancement <laughs> yeah. after finishing the map. So, so yeah. yeah, that was. That was no good. Well, <laughs> you you are st- the questions you, you're doing. The question I should have known the most. I didn't. <laughs> so that's great. <laughs> that's what always happens, yeah. though. <laughs> well, uh, so you now have three point three 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 repeating 
Uh, points. Oh, that's a good. I, I keep I keep it at that score. Yeah. It's, a, it's a good it's score. A good Very score. good score. <laughs> three point three, two, uh, two, three, two, three. Here is the last question. Okay. Get it, man. Get this it. one's a doozy. Mm. All right, get ready for this. If you get this correct, you will have beat Helen, uh, and you'll you'll be the uh, the number one. The number Unfortunately, one highest you lost the chance person. to take over the Void Frog yeah. podcast channel. You did and lose that. Chance. We won't yeah. be able to run Itch and Minecraft channel. <sighs> Question number five. With over five hundred thousand members worldwide, and mm. sixty-eight thousand followers on Instagram. The IJA, which stands for International Jugglers Association. Yeah. <laughs> he knows it. <laughs> yeah. <it's positive. laughs> was, was founded in what year? Oh, guess that's, that's guess <laughs> within 10 years. You get, you get ten, a 10 year ten buffer. Years. Okay. Within yep. 10 years. Guess what year was founded? Uh, 1967. That's like, oh, that's oh, close. I, I'm like, that hurts my heart. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, it's like, like, dang, oh, man. 1976. No. Oh, <laughs> no, no, no. I'm sorry. Wrong direction. We're getting, oh, getting colder. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, hmm. well, hey. Yeah. We'll give you. We'll, I'll give you one last guess. One last guess, and and go ahead. Go ahead. Very Lock it in. And the boy frogs trivia. Yeah, we are. Hmm. Yeah, the. He's Googling it right now. <laughs> we don't see him on camera. This isn't fair. This isn't fair. That's actually a good, good idea. Um, no, it's, it's probably not in the in the 19th century, I think. So, um, yeah, I can just say 1980, something like that. I'm, uh, I'm very sorry. Uh, yeah. The correct I, answer I don't know. is 1947. 47. Oh, you were like 67. Oh. Like, you got the hard one right. The, the last yeah, number. The seven. Yeah. You got the seven Man. right. Well, hey. You got your dream score, Asia. though. All, all three. Yeah, that's, that's 3.3 3 repeating. I don't Love even it. know how I'm going to write that on the certificate. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> It'll just be 3.3, 3, the whole, like, constantly going down the whole page. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was pretty good. Nice work oh. on the Void Frogs podcast. Thanks so much for uh, for playing along and, and yeah. joining in on that. And if you want to play well, along at home, fun. you can uh, write in the comments what you think the answers are ahead of time. Just go back and that's, watch it again. That's, <laughs> yeah, now that we've already given all yeah. the answers. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes. And pretend you don't know the answers. Yeah. Oh, okay. Go with your first guess. That's right. That's right. <laughs> oh man, uh, Ija, this has been yeah. a serious pleasure. I've enjoyed this very much. I'm uh, very tired, and yet you've given me energy, uh, and I appreciate you for that. And only energy. one coming. And only I think one that coming. every time you do one of those, I should say that on your videos, and we can make it booming, right? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> do, it. do it. Oh man! Hey, I uh, I've had a really good time. Thank you uh, so much for being here. Q, do you have any last questions for our friend Ija? Besides, like a question about, hey, do you want to give us your YouTube channel or something like that? Well, I guess I don't have any questions now, Stifler. Thanks. Oh. That's the one I can't pick. <laughs> So sorry. <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, but yeah. So thank you. Ija, I want to open the floor up to you, sir. I want to give you an opportunity. You will speak fall from right the heart. through it. The floor is open. Speak. Speak. Speak to the people. You can do it. You can even speak to the people in German if you want to. You say yep. whatever you want to say. That's right. Mm -hmm. Do it. What would you like to share? Yeah. 
es, es war, war viel Spaß hier auch im, in diesem tollen oh. Podcast. Auf jeden Fall yeah. abonnieren, die White Frogs. Ja. Yeah. Und natür natürlich auch bei mir vorbeischauen auf youtube.com slash Minecraft. Das ist der best beste Kanal auf, auf YouTube, auf jeden Fall. Und jetzt reden wir noch ein oh. bisschen weiter, damit sich die Void Fox fragen, was wir da hier denn gerade erzählen. Vielleicht denken sie, dass wir über, über really? sie reden, was wir auch gerade tun. Ja, yeah. and I just said that you're great guys and nothing more. <lacht> <lacht> I, I agree with 100% of what you just said. I'm going to translate it all before I agree with it. <laughs> just, just to make yeah. sure. Before we air it, I need to make sure that it's actually okay. <laughs> it should, I, thank you, man. I can send you subtitles if you want to. Ah, good, good. Hey, Smiley, oh, tell man. everybody where to find you, Twitter, YouTube, yes. all, that, all your addresses and stuff. Yeah. You can find me at slash user slash itcher minecraft on youtube and at itcher minecraft on twitter yep. yeah and that's and also at itcher minecraft on planet minecraft if that's yeah. the thing yeah so, yeah uh you have a website yeah, planet still minecraft. yeah itcher minecraft cool. that's where i post all my stuff you can get all the downloads and everything over there and uh yeah sweet well, dude, thank you again so much. Uh, yeah. This has been a real pleasure having you here. Yeah. Love uh, it. For all of Thanks for having me. Yeah, 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 yeah totally, these. totally. Genius. Uh, for all of you. Big shot coming through. That's, that's right. <laughs> yeah, watch Always. watch this guy for real. His channel is blowing up right now. It's going crazy. Yeah. So so seriously, go and, go and see what he's what he's doing because it's, it's magical. It's always been like magic to me because I've not understood any of it. Uh, but now it's like definitely going crazy. Um, but uh, thanks everybody else as well for listening in today on YouTube, Google Podcasts, Apple Podcasts, uh, Spotify, everywhere. Spreaker. Cans on a string. Yep, Anywhere that's right. <laughs> definitely. Uh, thank you and, and uh, subscribe to us if you would please. Check us out at thevoidfrogs.com or on Twitter at thevoidfrogs so you can see new episodes guest interviews every Wednesday. Maybe we'll get Itja back again because we had so much to talk about that we still haven't covered. So, um, Plus, you're just a cool dude. I've, I've been fanboying over here this whole time. I'm really sorry about that. I'm normally very composed, but uh, not this time. I don't know what it is. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> thanks. I'm, I'm fine with her. Good, fine. Good, good. Uh, so, thanks everybody for watching and, yeah. uh, and we're out. So, Peace. Bye bye, beautiful people oh, of the internet. Yes, that's it. You did it. <laughs> so glad ah. you did that. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. Yeah. Oh.